My name is Devondria Rose Muhammad. This is my summer ticket. Me and my classmates saw it on January 11th, 2015. My rights, my role in our liberty. One evening, a teenager was walking home from a store with his Skittles in an Arizona tea. As he was walking, he was talking on the phone with a friend and saw someone falling behind him. The boy became scared and ran for his life. He had no previous records of wrongdoing, but was fatally shot in the chest by a vigilante. We all know this person, Trayvon Martin. In January of 2013, an unarmed black man was riding his bike to get a snack for his son, was shot and killed. He had no criminal records. The officer who killed him was off duty working as a private security guard suspected him of being a burglar. The murdered man's name is Jordan Baker. As me and my classmates watched Selma, we saw how the 20th century leaders exercised their constitutional rights, individual freedoms, and used their self-determination to bring awareness to injustices during that time. Just as leaders of the Selma movement did, I also exercised my individual freedoms. I had an opportunity to work with the Ministry of Justice at the candlelight vigil of Jordan Baker. Although I didn't say a word, I stood there with a sign that read, hashtag justice for Jordan and hashtag all lives matter. My presence was a statement in itself. I used my constitutional First Amendment right freedom of speech to share with people that these senseless killings happen almost every day. But we must stand up for what is right and bring awareness to what is unjust. There are many other Trayvon Martins, Jordan Bakers, Eric Garners, and Tamir Rices. Another method to exercise our freedom of speech with great impact is with our dollars. After the death of Michael Brown and Eric Garner, people worldwide decided to boycott Black Friday. On Black Friday in 2014, there were over 147 protests throughout different cities. Protesters of police brutality did not shop on Black Friday, but instead used social media to bring awareness by hashtagging Black Lives Matter Friday. During Black Friday, the National Retail Federation stated spending was down by 11%, which equated to $7 million less than the year before. According to a study by Nielsen Company, blacks in America will have $1.1 trillion in collective buying powers in 2015, which makes black buying powers more relevant than ever. In conclusion, Selma is a powerful movie that expressed how and at what price black people have made progress to gain freedom, justice, and equality in order to have the ability to shape their own lives. Jordan Baker's mother made a statement after the grand jury decided not to indict the officer who killed her son. Justice delayed is not justice denied. Hashtag justice for Jordan. Hashtag Selma. Hashtag march on. Hashtag all lives matter. Thank you.